Hello, wanderers, and welcome. It's snowing, as you can see. I'm putting on my gloves. There we go. Let's take a walk through a Japanese garden in the winter. It's a beautiful snowy afternoon. We're going to enjoy a little bit of Zen peace in nature. And we're going to do some updates on the channel. And I am thrilled to share these updates. It's a great day for some reflection as well on 2022 and the year that was. So in 2022, Wanderers, we did a lot. I'm trying to think all the way back to last January. But we had uh, quite a few major trips. We had some beautiful camping trips, lots of hikes, truck camping in national parks. Our big trip though, if you'll remember, was this past summer when we went to the United Kingdom. We walked in London, Scotland, Wales. We went to Stonehenge. We went to Edinburgh. We saw the British Museum. So many memories. Went to the Scottish Highlands. I got COVID in London too. Had to isolate, got over it. The trip was amazing. A lot of good memories. We then went on a cross country road trip over 7,500 miles driven. Went from Chicago to Minneapolis to North Dakota, to Portland, to San Francisco, to Las Vegas. That's pretty. There's gravel under there, it's a Zen garden. From Las Vegas, we went down into New Mexico and Arizona, Texas, and then back up to Kentucky. What a trip. What a trip. We saw, memory serves me, almost 15 states, maybe more on that trip. We crossed every single state off of our bucket list, except for Alaska. Every single one of them. We also went to, I think 10 national parks this year. Lots of memories. Crater Lake was amazing. Walking solo in Carlsbad Caverns was unbelievable. The channel grew in big ways this past year in 2022. We're almost at 3,000 subscribers and 
The second channel was blown up too. Wander EDC is over 1,500 subscribers. Incredibly thankful. Most recently, we went to New York. I forgot, we went to Seattle. We went to New York. Been celebrating some amazing milestones with some amazing travel with all of you. And in between, we've done lots of walks in the Southeast, lots of small town walks, lots of state parks and hikes. It's been a lot of fun exploring and wandering with all of you. So the year in review was pretty crazy. Uh, go back, watch some of the videos that you might've missed. We, we did a lot together and we had a lot of fun. So what's next? What could top a year in which we went to New York and London, San Francisco, and Seattle and Chicago and Dallas and goodness gracious we went all over the place we saw so many amazing things we saw Stonehenge wow so how are we going to top an epic 2022 in 2023 on the bit of a wander channel well i've got incredible news to share with all of you in 2023 bit of a wander is going to japan finally finally it's been number one on my bucket list since college, I've wanted to explore Tokyo. I've wanted to explore Kyoto. I wanted to ride bullet trains through the countryside. I wanted to stay in capsule hotels and eat incredible food. And that desire only became stronger. During COVID, when I started watching Tokyo Explorer and Daniel and Yuka and so many other amazing channels, Lemmy and everybody, Paul, and it's, it's, it's an absolute dream of mine to see Japan and I didn't know when it was going to happen but now I do we are going this spring we're going to see cherry blossoms and we're going on a two-week Japanese trip and I can't wait to take you along for the ride we will live stream and we will shoot 4k videos and capture as much as possible and i'm just over the moon excited i want to thank my incredible wife who bought me this plane ticket to tokyo as a christmas present and i'm the luckiest guy in the world so everyone that's the news there's other plans in the works for 2023, potentially a trip to Eastern Canada. <clears throat> so Montreal, Quebec City, Toronto, Nova Scotia. Uh, there's gonna be lots of truck camping, the beast. Excited for that. But the big news is definitely that bit of a wonder is heading to Japan. I'll get you dates as soon as possible 
and I hope that everyone tunes in. For those wondering, yes, I will reach out to some of the other incredible YouTubers that we all know and love from Japan and try and meet up with them, hopefully do a walk. That would be a dream come true for me. The idea for this channel was born from watching Tokyo Explore walk the streets of Tokyo and not just the famous streets, the neighborhoods and take us to a place that we couldn't get to. And I'm beyond thrilled and excited that I'll finally be able to walk those streets myself. So come along in 2023 for exciting wanders, for more national parks, for more hiking, for more small towns, for more cities, a little bit more geo-guesser, truck camping, and a massive and exciting trip to Tokyo and Japan. I hope you're as excited as I am. And I hope that you've enjoyed this nice little walk in the snow and Japanese garden. This garden is located in Georgetown, Kentucky, believe it or not. It is a peaceful little spot that I've always loved and I'm excited to show it to you in the snow. What do you think, Wanderers? I'm gonna need lots of advice. I'm gonna need lots of tips. Where should I go? How should I handle two weeks in Japan? What's the best way to do it? Knowing that I won't get to see everything, what should I see? How long should I spend in Tokyo? When I leave Tokyo, should I use trains? Should I rent a car and strike out on my own into the countryside? Let me know in the chat if you're watching the premiere. Let me know in the comments if you're watching this later. I'm gonna start building my list now because spring will be here before we know it. I'll get you exact dates as soon as I book the tickets. And I just, I cannot thank you all enough for the incredible support that you've provided to the channel over the last two years. I'm beyond blessed to be able to create content in a community as supportive as this one. Um, all of you who support YouTube walkers are amazing. You make all this possible. There's the beast down here. which will, outside of the Tokyo trip, be the chariot that brings us on all of our adventures this year. I'm ready for more camping, I'm ready for more road trips. I'm ready to visit more places with all of you that I've never had a chance to go to before. All right, everyone, thank you. I hope you enjoyed this beautiful trip. 
through a snow-filled Japanese garden. And I hope you're looking forward to 2023 as much as I am. And I can't wait to take you all to Japan this spring. That's it for now. Thank you, wanderers. We will see you next time. Bye-bye.